Junior Senior. G'day YouTubers, it's Senior here from Junior Senior Gaming and today we're doing yet another instalment of 18 Wheels of Steel. Now, let's see, where were we when we last left off? I'm pretty sure it was rocks we were carrying last time, so let's have a look. Where are we up to now? Uh, we'll have a look at the ranking. Now, uh, yeah, we need to unlock these ones now. So, this is going to be interesting. We did that one did rocks and that last time so let's let's go see what we got in the jobs okay so 254 points for taking that load there um 266 points for taking debris to the airplane from the airplane crash site to come is it cumbrae i don't know all right i think i think i'm gonna do that one there let's do that one shall we so, debris from aeroplane crash site to Cumbrae junkyard. Right. Awesome. Absolutely brilliant. I love this game. Uh, I cannot wait to try some of the other ones that they have. You know, like uh, there's uh, American hauling and stuff like that. I can't wait for that. Look, it's a, a bit of rubbish or something like that in there. So, look, let's get right into it because otherwise we're going to be late. Whoops, come on, truck. Time has already started ticking. Need to put the lights on so we can see. Ah, awesome. So, um, this has been a lot of fun, this area. I mean, look at all the, the rubbish in that makes it more interesting. But I don't know if it's as hard as the ice one, I think. Oops, hang on, I've got to bring up the map. And where are we going? We are facing that way, so we need to turn right, uh, I think. I hope so, if, otherwise we're going the wrong way, uh, and that's no good. So, uh, indicators please, and away we go. Uh, let's have a look, any vehicles coming that way. Oh man, I had that truck hard, hard lock. And uh, I just made it past that rock, didn't I? Right. Fix that camera up. That track IR sounds really good. <laughs> One day. All good. So here's a Corolla here. Look, I'm going to quickly sneak around the Corolla because he is going so slow. Just there to annoy me. That's all he is doing. And uh, we just thrash it down the mountain and get to the actual the site there. Where is it? The junkyard where we need to go. And I'll just play that map up. There we go. We can see it a little bit better. And that way I can actually see where we need to go. And there's this dude going slow. Come on, mate. What are you doing? Um, I'm going to overtake him because there's nothing coming. And that is as fast as we can go. Now, look at that. Look at all these cars. Man, this place, you could actually, you know, like a car removalist would have a field day here. All these car bodies around the place. He would absolutely go to town. Because normally they say, oh, we'll give you money for your car bodies. Here they just go, we'll just take your car bodies for you. How about that? And going to get around this guy. There's a truck coming. So that's a negative. It's a negative, son. Man, look at that cliff. Wow. Um, should we overtake? Yeah, let's let's give it a whirl. Let's give it a whirl. Probably pretty dangerous, but um, that's all right. We're professionals here. We know what we're doing. These guys obviously don't. They don't have their lights on. They got no idea. And oh, look at this. There we go around here. 
Now, uh, we're not turning there, we are turning here. And I'm putting the clutch in thinking it's Euro Trucks, but it's not. And uh, just tried to look around the corner there and I couldn't really look around that corner too well, so never mind. Another car body, surprise, surprise. We should pick some of that up. Should be a quest where you have to pick up car bodies off the side of the road for this map. That would be cool because then we could make a bit of money on the site. Now, this is uh, the scenery in this game. I absolutely love it, guys. I think it's wonderful. I really do. Uh, and I think it is absolutely great. I was having a thought. Uh, you know how SCS has made... Well, they're making American Truck Simulator. They've done Euro Truck Simulator. Where's next? Well, I reckon Australia. Australian Truck Simulator. That would be awesome. I think that's already been done and it was done really bad though, so they'd have to call it something else. Um... But that would be really cool. I would be right into that game so bad. Oh, yeah. Be loving it. Oh, come on, mate. Going too slow. All these people travelling so slow down here, you'd think that uh, they might go a bit quicker. Anybody coming? Can't see around that corner, so it's not a good idea. Reach for those gears. And slows right down, don't they? Reach for the gears again. And we're keeping right over to our side of the road here because I don't want to have any altercations with the traffic, oncoming traffic. How did I know he was going to slow down there? I don't know, just a hunch, maybe? Just a guess? Right. Whoops. Now, he's slowed right down too. Um, no, not going. Let's go. Come on. And then he just rolls down the hill. I think he just put the clutch in. And now he's just angel. He's got angel gear going. That's why he's going so fast. Now, we are not too far away. We're got about, what, just over a third? Just over a third to go. And now this guy's slowed right down again. Uh, I need to get around him, I think. He's becoming a bit of a pain. And every time I go to think, oh yeah, I can get around him, he decides to just speed off down the road there. Look at that. And now we get stuck behind this truck. And, um... Wow, look at this. What is this? Is like a little mine or something up here? I don't know, maybe? Not sure what it is. Looks pretty cool. All these structures in there. Shantytown! Here we are. Welcome to Shantytown. Uh, Shantytown, I'm not sure if I mentioned this in the other videos, but Shantytown is basically a dodgy town that you know like a town made out of iron and scraps that's what we call in Australia shanty town we don't have uh, I don't think we have any of those I don't know maybe, maybe we are ah, actually we do we do have them and they're up north a lot of them are up north out in the bush you, you'll see them but very if you ever come here to Australia you don't want to go to those destinations because they will kill you out there. Serious? There is, if you, we have parts in Australia where 
um, if you're not Aboriginal, if you're a, a, what we what, what we get called white fellas, you can get into a lot of trouble and even dead. So um, I'm not making that up either. That is the truth. So uh, my uncle, he lives he lived up in that near that area, and uh, he got into a bit of trouble because he went the wrong way. He turned left instead of turning right one day and got into some trouble, so. So yeah, that is uh, up north towards Darwin, uh, which is uh, in the Northern Territory of Australia. For anybody who knows their little bit of geography about Australia. Now we are turning here and um, this guy was taking such a long time to get around that corner. I thought we were never gonna get there. But we should be getting there on time, which is very, very cool. Now, let's dodge that car. We don't want to hit it. Now, where is this thing? Sometimes I miss it. There it is. You can't miss this one. Now, I am not going to pass it. I'm going to slow right down before it. Because remember what happened the other day? It took me half an hour to get to that the thing half an hour to reverse it that's stupid <laughs> right so there's 266 points awesome let's do another one let's do another one shall we I'll have a drink of coffee from uh, the brand unnamed I won't I haven't got it showing no oh there we go oh, I went out this morning to the gym so all right thanks for your hard work you've become more respected among your colleagues now you are Mountain Goat. That's great. Thank you. <laughs> right. Now, what's next? We will take another job. Oh, there's a rusty old bus. Take that one. Or there is... Oh, look. There we go. Medical supplies. That's why... See, if we go rank, right? We have a look at rank. And... Oh, look. Now all of them are opened. So look, uh, we're going to, we'll do that one there, that's medical supplies. But I want to do a couple of these other ones as well, not just leave it at that. Because it's, um, what else have we got? So we got medical supplies, and, 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 let's do the medical supplies, let's do that one. So we need to go from there, we need to turn left, left and all the way down there and then turn right that's going to be a trip and a half i wonder if we're going to be able to do this in time let's let's see um what's that one that one is not so long i might actually do that one um the reason why i'm not doing this one here is because the video We've only got so long to do the video, so... Actually, no, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. The video might go over time, guys, but look, that's all right. We'll get it done. We'll get this done, eh? Instead of gabbing, jabbing her about it, jabbing, whatever. Let's get in there and get it done. Oh, yeah, I've never driven one of these trucks before. I oh, better check the map first, eh? Where, which way are we facing? We're facing that way. We need to go down that way, so that's all good. And we need to... Yeah, we're going the right way, so that's good. Awesome. Now, what's the horn sound like? Oh, it sounds like a, a truck horn, what I expected to hear. This is cool. This is... I like this. Oh, 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 oh. We damaged... The <laughs> sugar. We damaged the medical supplies. That's not good. We're not going to get full points for that, are we? Man, we only just started, too. Most people would say, oh, just restart it, senior, it's all good. No, we're not going to restart it. We're going to keep going. These people need those medical supplies. We need to get those medical supplies to them. Just need to slow it down a bit sometimes. Because I go too quick. Right. Thank goodness nobody's coming around that corner. And there's another guy. How's it going, mate? And uh, gear it down. Man, this truck is an old... It looks like an old army truck. 
sort of. I don't think they had fans in them back when they were in the army, but anyway. Still looks pretty cool. Alright. Now we're coming up to the road here. We need to turn left. I'll just quickly have a look. Doesn't look like anything's coming, so we'll just go. And nothing was coming anyway. See the indicator's a little light bulb on the dash. Because essentially, I suppose that's what they all they are, really, isn't it? So, uh, try and keep this on the road and not go off the road, I think. And uh, that should be good if we can do that. So there's the bigger picture of the map. And that is as fast as she'll go. So um, hopefully we don't come across too much traffic because the traffic really does mess up the it really does stuff you up and you have, you got to overtake them because if you don't overtake them then they'll um, stuff your time up and you'll be late and that's it lose points and there's some first bit of traffic there that's going our way they're gonna mess us up I reckon so yeah get around there oh 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 going around. Oh no I'm not, there's a, there's a car coming. He was going, look this guy's going so slow. He's going to speed up now, you watch. There we go. Nicely around that corner, get around that guy. And uh, let's see, what else we got around here? Oops, another Tarago coming our way. And this truck, the steering in this is definitely different. It is not, not the same as the other trucks. It's uh, got a bit touchier steering. Oh man, we're right up that guy's bum, see that? <laughs> scare the crap out of him. Now, uh, not going to overtake here. Not a good idea. Um, there's another guy going really slow as well. Oh man. Now he takes off really fast and then goes really slow. Oh dear. Alright don't have enough up and go and I think we're gonna to have to stay here for the time being because I just don't have enough get up and go to get past these two at the moment now still got that there's the end part there so we still got a bit to go there's another shanty town they, these guys are just taken off and gone. Look at that. Right, now. Oops, he's braking. Reach for those gears, son. There we go. Um, I may have been able to overtake him there, but I'm just, just not sure about it. Oh dear. Uh, oh, 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 he's decided to stop all of a sudden. Awesome. Come on, let's go. It's so slow around here. Oh my goodness. What's with the slowness? Oh look, now you speed up. Wonderful. Alright, so by the time we catch him, he'll slow down again. And then it'll be just ping pong, back and forth. Fast, slow, fast, slow. Um, there is a section we might be able to pass him. Like now, let's just go around him now because he's pissing me off. And um, then 
reckon there's this other guy. Oh, yeah, there he is. He's a while up there, so we'll get there soon. There's plenty of... There's another dude in front of him. We're giving it... Well, I'm giving it all she's got, Captain. If I give it any more, she'll blow. Um, going as fast as this truck can take us. And um, I think that's pretty much it, son. That's all we're going to go. Um, there's more vehicles up front. So it just gets more and more vehicles pile up. Now, uh, well, my lights, that's what I need. That's what was missing, my lights. Right, so now there's a whole heap of traffic and they're gonna make it so you can't overtake. So, where's everyone going? And let's go around them here. So, let's zoom into that map. There we are. There's a section there. Turn those white wipers on. He's going through the pavement. Look at that. Awesome. <laughs> so we are going to turn here. And try and get around them. Because they are donkeys. They're taking their time. Oh, excuse me. It's hay fever. Man. Man. Still, it's the end of winter coming on to spring. It always gets me. It always makes me sneeze. Right, now, the question is. Ooh, I thought that was something blowing up in the truck then. The question is, how. Oh no, we're going to actually get a straight and they're going to get a turn. So that's funny. That's going to make it better for us. Ah, oh, tropical storms going on. And this guy's going slow. Now, is he going to turn? Yes, he is. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much. We will go straight. Just realised my screen wasn't in the centre. Uh, thank goodness that truck didn't come around that corner before. As I was turning it. Play that map up again so we can see where we're going. And we're going to turn those wipers off. And um, then let's see, we've got a little bit more of a tricky, tricky part. I think the trickiest part was back there. Overtaken him, we got the pace. May as well. Even though it's on a bit of a blind corner, it's not a very good thing to do. Uh, let's see. Still got a fair way to go, don't we? It's another truck the same as ours. Pretty cool. Now, uh, it's not turning down there. How's our fuel situation going? Temperature's fine. Um, fuel is halfway, so... Um, keep... Oh, here we go. Keep... No, no, he's speeding up, so can't do anything about that. And there's a whole heap of vehicles. Awesome. Let's just go slow now. And this is what makes the the game very hard, the traffic. Comes smashing down the road and all of a sudden, oh, this everyone's stopped. We may as well get out and walk. Now, uh, one of the things that I've noticed is that I'm over revving a little bit. That's because I'm looking down there at the speedo. Oh, you are a donkey, you are. And it's not, the speedo's not, the, oh, look at that. Thanks, mate. No, nah, screw you, I'm going. I'm 
I'm looking down at the speedo and he's dragging me. Look at that. A hole. Bloody AI. It should be a hole, not AI. Just a hole. Artificial holes or something. And let's see if we can just uh, race down here and pull into here. Man, that's... Oh, jeez. I thought he was going to go straight into the, into the grill. Straight into the front of the bumper there. Um, we're moving at a snail's pace. Come on, people. Oh, jeez. Makes it a bit painful when we're moving so slow. We get our pace up and then all of a sudden, yeah, we've got to stop. And it doesn't help that they're throwing more and more vehicles in the mix. There you go, mate. Back off because we got tourists now. Tourists in there. Oh, look. Have a look. Oh, dear. Have a look at that over there. Isn't that wonderful? The scrap heap yard. Oh, that looks wonderful. Oh, I think it's a mill, dear. Not a scrap heap yard. But anyway. Oh, that's wonderful. <laughs> they slowed right down, the idiots. <laughs> oh, dear. All right. Let's get around these tourists. There we go. Nicely done. And then we have to go... Keep going this way. And just up here there is a right turn just after the service station. Could be a Texaco or something like that, I don't know. Um, a shell service station, who knows. This guy's got medical supplies as well, but obviously he's not on a deadline. Like I am. Come on, mate! I'm on a deadline! Got things to do! Places to be! I gotta move! Oh uh, dear. Anyway. Uh, getting there. <laughs> Where's it? Oh, there's the service station, so we need to turn right here somewhere. Where is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? It's there? It's, there it is. That's where we need to turn. And what do you know? He just has to turn there as well. So, whoa, geez, we nearly hit that vehicle there, the abandoned van on the side of the road. Oh, jeez. It's dark and hard to see. Nobody saw that I nearly hit that car back there. That's all good. <laughs> There's a truck coming. A lot of medical supplies coming up and down this area. Ah, oh, I hate that, how they do that. So frustrating when they go so slow and then they go, off they go. Now, uh, still got a little bit to go, eh? Oh, uh, this is uh, pretty dangerous if I was to overtake now because you can't really see and it makes it really hard. But we wait till we get maybe. Oh, he's sped off. That's nice of him. Turn around the corner here and um, no, no, not going to do it. I turn my lights right off. That was nice. over here and then we got to turn right uh, I don't, yeah 
I think we just wait behind this guy, eh? We got time up our sleeve. We just got to go down that little little road section there, and then we're we're laughing. And then we're done. All right. Oh man, it's it's terrible in the dark. I mean, it's like so much harder in the dark as well so it's not it's not really that easy at this point in time don't you break yeah come on I'll just put alongside him and somebody yell out the window move it or lose it um, or the somebody yell out the accelerators on the right as we're going past and uh, that'll give him incentive to move a bit quicker. Now, one thing I didn't think of is this guy going down the same section that I'm going down, I'd say he is. And that's gonna be a pain. Um, now, which way does that road go? Is, this, is it a right here or? right just here somewhere there it is there right there and he's gone forward thank you very much we're going to turn down here thank you and that is it now we just got this little bit of road to go down and we're there see just up there we really have to slow it down coming up to that little windy bit there going down the hill or up the hill whichever it may be might be up the hill turn the high beams on I think no, they don't really do much do they in this truck pretty pointless right so uh, let's see scooting around here and then yeah we still got a little bit to go I would talk about the scenery, but I just can't see anything. There's no scenery to look at at the moment. It's pretty damn dark. There's not much you can do about it. Going as fast as this rig can take us. And, uh, yeah, that's it. That is pretty much it, folks. Now, I was meant to do some Formula 1, some F1 today, but, gee, I ran out of time. I just uh, don't have the time to do it today actually going to take some me time out today and go out and have have a wonderful lunch so um, that'll be different you know so have a wonderful lunch and you know I had the gym this morning do some stuff that uh, that I don't don't normally do all the time because I've been so busy lately I thought that'd be a good idea oh geez now here we come up to these uh, this really windy, twisty section. And look, that's what happened to the last truck that came up here. And there we go. Up here. And around. Whoa, man, it is so hard to see that road. I don't know if you can see this on the video, but that road is very very hard to see it's like you either look in the light or you look in the dark right now I'm looking in the dark part to try and see the the road and I'm following it seems to be all right following it that way but um, zoom that map in but over on the other right hand side I can't really see the road at all Thank goodness there's no traffic coming the opposite direction. That'd be terrible. Make it that extra special hard. Right. Oi, yay, 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 yay. Okay. Now, uh, we got one more big turn here and we got to keep it on the road and there we go now 
this last little turn and then we're on the straight and narrow well not straight and narrow but we're on the home stretch how about that that sounds better there we go home stretch going up a hill hopefully no traffic comes this way I don't want any traffic now all right so what else have we got there we go um, now that's it that's pretty much look how straight it is now it's nice and straight got no more gears we are hauling us and there we go look at this no worries need some reflectors on the side of the road I think that would help out a lot and all right um, where is oh look we're nearly there nearly there and just over here whoa whoa getting bumpy getting bumpy and there's the moon that's nice and around here there it is there is the destination thing and we made it in so much time so much extra time they're gonna think that we are just a race driver and there we go excellent awesome how much damage oh oh minus 62 points oh that was big bit of damage that was oh dear oh well you know that is that happens when you're trucking you get a little bit of damage here and there so what do we have this time see bulldozers uh, we have uh, llama yarn llama yarn and we have military equipment oh so that's what that other one was military equipment all right uh, that's actually quite low points for the destination you have to drive, the distance you have to drive, and what you're carrying as well. So, why are we doing that one in a hurry? Um, bulldozers. I think we'll do bulldozers next. That looks pretty good. But uh, if we have a look at the ranking, we are getting closer. So, we've only got like that one there. And then, when it, you know, this one or this one to do you know so i think they'll pop up very soon very very soon so well guys look that is pretty much it for this episode it did go a little bit longer than normal but um considering we did the the distance we did today and we got a fair bit done in this game so well look thank you very much for watching look if you like this video then don't forget to share share it with your mum share it with the cat share it with the sister share it with the daughter share it with anyone you'd like to share it with doesn't bother me as long as you share uh, but that's pretty much it for me guys keep the shiny side on the greasy side down and i'm 10 10 on the side and remember game on thanks for watching youtubers if you'd like to see more videos then click on the links beside just over here we have a look at 18 wheels of steel extreme trucker 2 and we go from la paz to corico just down there we have a look at the peterbilt 351 for euro truck simulator 2 and it's Peterbilt Tribute Week, so we're going to challenge a whole heap of Peterbilts against each other. If you'd like to visit our website or you'd like to subscribe, then click on the links below. Thanks again for watching, YouTubers, and remember, game on!